I just want to post this video of a 2007 XC90 um, that's not charging uh, the battery at the moment. Um, it stalled out on the owner and uh, a couple times after two different jumps. So there's some of this uh, online, but I haven't found a video of a 2007 with this uh, particular issue. Um, the um, charging system is is run by this strange coupler um, that Volvo designed and FOMOCO. Um, see, it's gear driven off the alternator through this belt, this tiny little belt that goes right on to this gear right here. So the belt sits half on the alternator gear and half on this gear. And what happens is the bolt that holds the gear onto the motor actually comes loose. And I, I um, loosened this a little bit with my fingers, but this was literally loose and um, just came right out like this. And then you can take this gear off. And it does have a, um, it's got a church key in there somewhere. Or maybe it doesn't. I thought it did, but um, anyways. So, 2007 3.2 uh, Volvo XC90. Um, the alternator is right under the intake. Um, you just have to disconnect the throttle body. Um, there's two mounting bolts. You can see them actually right there. There's two mounting bolts on the bottom of the intake. And obviously all the electrical connectors for the um, throttle body. Uh, electronic throttle body, of course. And... Um, a fre uh, fresh air line right here and um, it comes up just like this and you can snake it past the um, the AC uh, compressor and the power steering hose right here um, the intake when it's in the car of course it looks like like this just like that and uh, it's actually pretty huge when it's out of the car I literally can't even hold it far enough away from my uh, phone um, to take a video of it. But um, yeah, I just wanted to show people if they're having um, charging issues with their 3.2 um, to check this stupid bolt first, which Volvo updated a new bolt um, because some people are saying your your um, belt can be the belt the teeth on the belt can be rounded but mine are absolutely perfect on this one and um, it hasn't actually done any damage so I'm gonna put some um, uh, I'm gonna put some um, permanent um, Loctite on this this is what Volvo does um, you can put some permanent Loctite on this um, I, I don't even use the red or the blue Loctite I use the green it's made for metal on metal um, which this is so I'm gonna do that and then um, tighten this and uh, let it dry for a while before I uh, attempt to start the car and, and uh, test it. So that's it. Um, that's what the alternator looks like. It's worth uh, about 600 from Volvo. I think about 550 right now. And um, if you need the um, Volvo info off it, my hand's shaking a good amount, but. There it is right there. Anyways, I'm going to put this on YouTube because uh, I haven't seen a video for this type of alternator yet with the um, the belt drive. So um, I've only seen like a, a lot of stuff on the V8s. Um, they say the 3.2 alternator is a lot more reliable than the V8 uh, alternator. Um, so... I'm going to give this one a chance to um, go back in the car and uh, keep charging keep charging her battery. So I'm going to replace the battery too because it was deep cycled. So it's probably completely trashed since it is original and it's six years old. So, all right. Thanks, guys.